Girl, if you only knew what they are doing after midnight. Neng, sang, sam. Review exposition and analysis commentary and thoughts show featuring Lovely Writer episode 3. So, mm -hmm. my god, Jean, don't you have any self love? Self love? <laughs> Aren't you like ashamed of yourself? Like, you allow this man to stay in your house? Like, just like that? And a couple of days later, you are already kissing him, but. I mean, I cannot blame him. Like, Nobseb is quite handsome, and yeah, he looks so hot when he's shirtless. So, let's see. Let's see um, what is gonna be the aftermath of that kiss, and if there's gonna be third base, or in gay terms, sex. <laughs> Shh, just kidding. <laughs> I. Girl, in the hallways, is that really happening in college? Like, aren't you supposed to find that? <laughs> He's not kissing him. <laughs> He's not kissing him. <laughs> Direct camera angle direct. <laughs> look, girl, look how awkward that set is. <laughs> That's why, that's why, sir. That's why it's important to have workshop to build chemistry. Like, girl, you need to open up to your partner, and there's a there's nothing place like a workshop for that to do, for you to do that. You don't know what I'm saying? Like, if you are awkward with your partner, then what else is gonna happen with your series? Oh my God. <laughs> That's quite, you know, I'm quite bothered by that part. Like, he's trying his best to segue the conversation to his novel, but Bua, the publishing editor, was ever just cut the line off. Like, it's kind of frustrating. What if that happens to me? I'm, more, I'm imagining what if that happens to me. Like, 
why don't just Bua be honest with him? Like, there, give him some like constructive criticisms or whatsoever, right? With his work, if there's something wrong that, or if she finds something that is off, just give him, just be truthful or just be honest with um him. Not like that. You're avoiding the conversation. God, aren't they gonna be like awkward with each other or something? Okay. Girl, that is a lie. ไม่ได้มีอาการอะไรวะคุณจะเป็นพ่อกัดน้องเหรอครับอุ๊ยไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไอ้ไม่มีใครเลยวันนี้นะผมไม่หาภาพดีแ
าความจริงเองก็ได้ไม่ผิดหวังผมแล้วก็มีเวลาว่างงานให้อ่าแต่ที่ผมบอกว่าพี่คุณนายด้อนผมเนี่ยมันจะไม่ได้แปลว่าผมไม่พูดความจริงทำไมมึงอยากเขียนวายเขียนวายไม่ได้ห้างเลยพี่มึงไม่เคยเขียนมาก่อนว่ะแต่มึงจะโดนกดดันแต่จะโดนดีบังคับนะครับ It depends on some people. Some people find it easy. Some people find it hard. And in my case, um, I have a lot of um potential, potential, um, plot that I think of. But the thing is, I'm having difficulty with like the execution of it. Like I can write, right? But I cannot have that consistency of. Having a good day where I can write, let's say ten, ten thousand words. Um, let's say yeah. At one, one, one time I managed to write like ten thousand words in one day. But in, like let's say two days later, girl, even five hundred words. <laughs> That's the only thing that I can come up with. So, yeah, it's it's difficult. There's there's different type of writers out there. อย่างนั้นยายวายผู้ชายเขียนไม่ใช่น้องๆหรือว่าแต่ผมอาจจะประสบความสำเร็จแบบพี่บ้างไงแต่ผมก็อาจจะได้มีโอกาสแต่ว
I mean, it's not that bad to mute people on Twitter, especially if they annoy you. Like, that's your liberty. That's your freedom to do so. If that is how you will find peace, you know, in times of desperation, desperation then do so, you're free to do so. Editor, my, it's so difficult, really, to face multiple revisions. <laughs> my god, this is already borderline satire, girl. And see? You just need to take a bath. <laughs> and <laughs> let me just say that this is like the typical scenes that we see in the movies or in the novels. You know, one character is feeling sick. Oh, he's smiling. It's like he feels sick. Then the other one is gonna take care of the person. And then when he wakes up, he's gonna see that there's a blanket or he's waiting for him to wake up. You know, sitting beside him. Then he's gonna develop something <laughs> and then he's gonna realize that shit I'm falling for him <laughs> and then he's gonna distance himself <laughs> and then that distance will just gonna prove how much he loves him <laughs> girl I already watched so many rom-coms and read so many novels Okay, that shit, it's always like the best seller. I'm so sorry. Hmm? We full course meal, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna give my um, opinion about this topic because I have some friends who um, shared their experience with me. So they said that um, you just have to relax, okay? Take a deep breath and then always coordinate with your top notch. <laughs> You know, ask him if it is, you know, okay to slow down if everything is like tight. <laughs> According to my friends, yes, what's my friend who shared, you know, his experience and yeah. 
<laughs> it also helps um, to use some moisturize. Moisturizer! <laughs> Skincare! <laughs> no, I mean lubricant. Some in that attire, ha. Huh? Oh, ah! Upset. He is flustered. You know what? This is this is like the thing about guys who is so very um complimentary. Complimentary. You know, guys who likes to compliment or knows how to use their words well. You don't know if they're like just having a casual conversation conversation <laughs> conversation or they're flirting with you. <sighs> That's why girls really we really need to filter. Filter <laughs> Speaker, oh my God. <laughs> I am not watching. Kakalain mga tao, nanonood ako ng po. <laughs> well, girl, you're the one who opened the file. <laughs> then why there's moaning? Ay! Headboard. <laughs> yeah, I think you should stop. It's kinda awkward. Oi! 
really? No, no, I think it's not gonna do it. I. I. Well, at least he said sorry and he asked him if he is okay. And when he said stop, Nabsib, stop. Boys, yeah, take notes. Okay, take notes. I mean, it was an honest mistake. As if he's in <laughs> purposely go went there. Well, sadly, they're not. It's okay, baby boy. You can have Tawan. The one who's playing Tawan. I don't know his name. What is his name again? <laughs> <laughs> if 
fairness, ah, if I don't know that this is a series within a series, yeah. I will... Girl... It could pass as a... as an original series. Oi! 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 It's okay, baby. There's second time. Hey, Stevie. Hey, bummer. <laughs> I know how it feels, you know, to stood up by your date. Oh, <laughs> looks so handsome. Girl, if you only knew what they are doing after midnight. <laughs> We are not close, but he agreed to practice a kissing scene with him just because Nabsib wants to know how it feels to be, you know, in character. They're not close. Okay, whatever. And if I may add, Jane also agreed to do the positioning thing for him to know how it feels to be in that moment without really doing the deed of honor. If that is not close, then I don't know what it is. <laughs> True. <laughs> Liar. Oi! He needs to move out. Is he gonna stop him? <laughs> Girl. Oi? Ah! After I move. Ah, okay, he gets. <laughs> move in, not move out. Okay. <laughs> Oi. Oi. Oi.
Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my god. He's already having realizations. Oh, girl, what's with that? gonna happen? My goodness, ha? That is such a bummer. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> thoughts on episode 3. Um, there are some things that um, I thought was gonna happen, but um, it went south. <laughs> My god, Tiffy, how could you? <laughs> no. There's some things here that was um, exposed. Um, that is the reality of uh, production or behind the cameras of series. Um, there are some things that the producers um, wants to happen, even though you know um, the actors are not okay with it. They have to comply because <laughs> they're the one who's producing the series. They're the one who's paying you and paying all the you know mm, the crews and whatsoever. So. He's the she. She's the boss, and you need to comply with his, with her requests. And yeah, I do understand. Um, if Nabsib is really having a hard time, maybe there's something happened between him and A that we don't know yet. But yeah, one one more thing. I don't think I don't really believe that they went workshop <laughs> because there's a disconnection between um A E and A and <laughs> Nabsib. I think Jin is already starting to develop feelings for Nabsib and it's evident in the last part of the episode where he showed him away where clearly that is like the opposite opposite of what he is feeling. So I guess we're gonna see an episode 4 if Jin will use his current state of drunkness and you know have with Nabsib, but I guess Nabsib is gentleman enough for him not to pursue the intercourse with Jean, knowing that he is not sober. So, yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, thank you so much, you guys, for watching this reaction video, and I guess I'll see you guys on the next one.